My name is Yuan Jiu Huang, and I'm a business professor of the University of Central Florida. I'm going to talk about rhythm making. Bassoon rhythm making is really crucial for any bassoonist. However, it needs some time uh, to practice and to work on to make your own read. So make sure to keep working and keep practicing. I would like to introduce my rhythm making tools. This is a cane, sandpaper, plaque, shaper, rulers, diamond file, file, foaming mandal, reamer, diamond reamer, mandal, plier, and knife. And I'm going to use only really basic rhythm making tools. So I'm going to use it just for this and talk about how you can add just your read. First, please check the opening of the blade. Okay, so your read is to open. Then use your mandal, use your plier to close a little bit. Why? If your opening is too open, really hard to use air to produce a sound. So make sure need to have a really even nice opening. Okay. So here, make sure you use the plier and close little by little this way. Okay. And your read, opening of the read is too close, right? Then you have to use your plier and use it this way to open a little bit more, okay? If your read is too close, it's gonna be really hard to respond and your sounds is not going to project well, okay? So make sure you use your plier this way and then open little by little but please make sure you have to play the bassoon. Check the sound. And you need to have a really nice and open, not too open and not too close, very even, rounded, like this kind of a shape, okay? And then please check the wire balance. Uh, I usually explain first the wire should be a little bit flatter and second and third wire should be very rounded. So you can check the wire balance. And then if it's not too um, really open, then make sure you use your wire and just to little by little like this. So you are repositioned to your read. Okay, so